If everybody would be with vegan, I would be too. Can't you make moral decisions for yourself? Why do you have to look for of course, the crowd? Um, does an apple want to an be eaten? An apple eat? doesn't know what it wants. It's an apple. How do you know that? Why would you tr try to find the right way to cut an animal's head off when you can just be vegan? <laughs> what do you think the cow would say to you if they could speak? Do you agree with the sign or do you disagree with the sign? I actually disagree. You disagree? Because okay. I think it's all about uh, change food. I mean, other animals can eat other animals, but why can't uh, we just do like them? So you mean like a food chain? Yes, food chain. Okay, so if other animals can eat other yes. animals, why can't we? Yes. Okay. Because other animals are in a survival situation, aren't they? Yes, but I mean, we are kind of animals too. Yeah, of course. So, if we don't need animals anymore, we will just eat vegetables and I think it's not enough for the human body. Um, so, you, you think that we eat animals because we need to? Yes, of course. Like a lion needs to? Yes, food. but of course I disagree with the way we kill him. We kill them because um, we kill them in a very inappropriate way and we have to change it, but I think nowadays we could um, imagine other solutions to kill them. Um, in a nicer way, I would say. A nicer way to kill yeah, because now. Okay, but why, wait a second. Why do you care? Because in nature, they don't—they're not nice to animals. And you said other animals. Here, let me let me say this first. Other animals are cruel to other animals in nature. Of course. So why can't we be cruel to animals? Because we have the possibility to think. We have a brain. We have a different soul. And I think we have the power to not be cruel. And animals don't have that power. Okay, you just answered your first question. Yes. Do you know that, don't you? Uh, Do you I see what happened just then? Let me explain to you. Explain me. You said, uh, why can't we eat animals? Other animals eat animals in nature. Yes. And then, I, uh, and, then, and then you said we should be nicer to animals. I said, why do you care? Other animals are cruel to other animals in yes, nature. I mean... And I said, why shouldn't we be cruel to animals? And then you said, one second, let me finish. And then you can talk. And then you said, well, because we've got the, the, we can think rationally. We've got and animal, other animals can't. So we can think about morality and other animals of course, aren't in this situation too. But I didn't say like morality is to not eat animals. I said morality is about to eat them, but in a more appropriate way. Not by kill them uh, by hundreds. I mean, nowadays we kill them in a very, very hard... A hundred, you think? Hundreds? Yes. It's more like trillions. Just like, it's more more like, do you know the number trillion? Yes, yes. It's like, yeah, trillions, there's yeah, a million, yeah. yes. there's a billion, yes. then trillion. there's a trillion. Yes, that was, we we uh, kill was, trillions of animals yes. every year. Of course. Yeah. And I mean, even if we don't kill them, animals will do it. So really? it's not possible. I mean, no, it's well, that's natural. Not true. It, it, that's not it's actually not, true. Why? And do it's you, not you think animals will not eat other animals? Well, you said that the animals that we are killing right now, other animals would eat them. Of course. How do you think? Well, they wouldn't exist. They just we breed them into existence. These animals. Sure, but so I how mean, would other animals eat them if they didn't exist? <laughs> I mean, when you, you think, say uh, okay. When, imagine, it? imagine now every human stop eating animals. You think uh, other animals? We also stop eating other animals? Oh, well, I'm not having a conversation with another animal. I'm having a conversation with a, <laughs> a, a rational thinking human, like you said at the start. Of course, but yeah. So you I, can choose. Because you're, you're saying we, we sh you can choose not to eat animals, and you of can course. and you will survive. You will actually thrive. Of course, I, I will survive. But I mean, since the dawn of time, we are eating animals, and I don't. Okay. I don't okay. understand We've done a lot why. Of things. Why nowadays okay. we will have to stop it? Because it's. You said well for the same reason. You think we shouldn't be cruel to animals? Of course, because now we eat them like they are not even. Not like they are not even. Um, how do we say like? Um, they are not living, like we consider them like objects, yeah. but they are not. Of course, they are, um, they are animals. They, I have a cat, and it will destroy me to eat my cat, for example. What if I, wait, 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 wait a second. If your cat was in nature, another, another animal would eat them. Of so why, why can't I eat your cat? Because, I mean, you could, like in other, are you, are you in, 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 other you? in other countries, in no, China, no, no, no. in China, no, for here, example. In this country, with your, where do you live? Uh, I live in France. You, okay, I'll come to France. Can I come <laughs> to France tomorrow and kill your cat and eat them?
No. Well, uh, well animals but eat. You, you could, but, an, but animals eat other animals. Yes, but it's my it's my pet. But if it was not my pet. Okay. So your, you does could. your neighbour have any animals? What? Does your neighbour have any animals? No. Okay. What about these pigeons here? Uh, I, I I could can eat. Can I them. can I kill those pigeons? If you want. Do you care? Of course I care, but if you don't okay. do Why it. Why do you care? This is nature. Yes, of course I care. I, uh, when I eat meat, of course I think about the fact that they were killed, and it, this fact makes me sad. But why? It's nature. <laughs> of course it's nature, but. Do you think animals get sad when they kill in nature? Yes. You think they get sad when they kill uh, when they have to kill an antelope? I, I mean, if they don't eat animals, they will die. So. Okay. Yeah. But what I'm trying to say to you is, you're not like an animal in nature. You are a human being in yes, civilization who. Of course. And I don't think that you're the same as a carnival. No, we are not the same. You, you look, look, you have no claws and teeth, and you see a pigeon fly past like that. You didn't want to chase them and eat them. No. So that's not. It's not even in your nature to kill animals. It's not in my nature because we live uh, with all of this globalization. We have supermarket. We have a lot of industrial food. Yeah. But I mean. One day we will... So wait a second. Do you think it's in humans' nature to want to kill animals? Of course. I mean... So, so okay. children. Let's just talk about children. Okay. Do you think it's in a child's nature so they're, they're less conditioned by society? Nowadays... When you get a child and an animal, do you think it's in their nature to want to kill that animal or to play with them? And... Okay. I think nowadays it's not because children have enough food because... Um, I mean, there is supermarket. They have a lot of different kind of food. But... Uh, if you take like 200 years ago, people 200 had... years ago, a child would want to kill an animal of just course. by looking. So they would just jump on a pigeon yes. like, I will kill... Yes, but so. how do you want to eat if you don't kill animals? Okay, imagine so. now there is no supermarket, how you will eat? Oh yeah, no, in a survival situation, things change. Of course, but... Yeah, things change, maybe I'd eat you. Yes. In a survival, like, of you course. know, in a, we're about to die, maybe yes. I, maybe I go crazy. Yes. Who knows? Yeah. But why do I care about that? I care about right now here with you. Yes. Do you right now here with you? Do you think um do you think killing an animal so you can eat them is wrong if you've got other food to eat? I mean, I think it's a very hard choice to do. Um, I actually consider this uh, choice. I wanted to be vegan before, but I just think that you know it's natural. And why do you care about? Wait, why do you keep saying natural? Because, because why do you care about what's it's natural? Food. So, you know, like there's horrible things that happen in nature all the time. Yes. But and if okay, if we, tomorrow I want to eat a rabbit, and you tell me no, don't eat this rabbit, just eat vegetables. I will, but maybe a wolf will eat this rabbit. So I don't care what the wolf does. I'm not going to eat you because a wolf eats another wolf. Yes, but no, no, but no matter what, if a, every animals are going to die. Should we copy? What animals do in nature is what I'm asking you. We don't, we don't actually copy them. No, no, you are. You're saying we should act as a wolf acts in no, nature. Uh, no, because you're saying if you want to eat a rabbit, yes. why shouldn't you be able to? If a wolf is going to eat the rabbit, yes. So, you're, so what you're essentially saying is we should copy the behavior of animals in a survival situation yes, copy, in society. Yes, but not exactly okay. in the same way because. So, well, well, wait a second. Well, I don't want to hurt so, the rabbit. So you're now changing the rules a little bit of nature. <laughs> No, you yes, are. You yes. are changing the rules. You too. So, so if you've got the power, of course. I yes. don't think. What, I don't care about what's natural. Okay. I care about. You don't what's, care about no, chain food. I don't care about the food chain. Food chain. Sorry. I care about morality and ethics. And is it is it okay to do? Is it morally okay to do? Just but, because animals kill each other in nature, I'm not going to kill you and then say, well, animals kill each other. I think that's crazy. But I mean, okay. So I now, don't care what happens in nature. That's my point. But. If you don't care what's happened in nature, you know uh, deep inside you that animals are dying every day and even if you don't eat them, there will always be someone that will eat animals. Okay. And just because I don't uh, murder people, there's always going to be someone who will murder people, but I don't it's, do it. It's, it's not the same thing. because It is the same thing. You're saying that because, really. I, because yeah, but you're, you're basically saying that even if I don't eat animals, animals are still going to die? Yes. If but I don't kill people, people are still going to be murdered. Of because course. I'm just because I'm not a murderer. So, so should I just go murder now? Who cares? No, because the murder is not what the human body needs. What human body needs uh, animal meat. No, 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 no. no. Now you're changing the argument. No, no, no. no, no. no, no. You're changing I, the I'm argument. I'm not changing my. You are. Uh, you're the first. Let's stick to this first, so you, okay. you don't jump around. Then we can talk about okay. what human needs. You're saying that if I don't eat animals, animals are going to get killed anyway. So what's yes. the point? 
So maybe I should just eat the animals anyway. Okay, but it's one of my... One sec, one sec. Okay. So, my, my counter to you, just so you're clear, is that people are still going to murder other people, so why don't I go out and murder people? Because, I mean, why would you kill other people? Well, I'm just, because people are going to get killed anyway. <laughs> yes, of course, but you don't need them. I don't need to kill them, exactly. Yes. Okay, so I don't need to kill them, but they're going to get killed anyway, so why can't I? No, they will not get killed. They will... They're going to get killed anyway. So Why? What I care about, right, is my personal contribution. Okay. Yeah. I understand. So, so you, like, if you don't go and kick that pigeon, you're not going to stop everyone from kicking pigeons in the world. Oh, yes. But you're not going to kick that pigeon. Mm -hmm. That's what morality, your, your morality is. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But I think morality can be different for different everyone. People. Yeah. For me, morality is... Subjective. Yes, of course, subjective. Of course. I mean, to you maybe it's horrible what I'm doing, but I mean, I have a question. You have already met, uh, eat meat before? For 26 years? I didn't know. I didn't really know. But why uh, did you become vegan? Can I show you? Yes. Okay. I'm going to show you what happens to animals. This is... um. Okay, I, I understand. And yeah. this is what I was talking this about. This is a gas chamber. Okay. This is suffering in the CO2 gas, it burns them and they suffocate Okay, I have already seen a thousand of videos like this. You don't care about horrible. this? It's horrible. Of course I care. And okay. I, I, I but, cry, but, I cry every, but why do you, every time I'm seeing it. But why I, do you care this is natural? No, this is not natural. This is not natural. To kill them in that way, okay. it's not natural. So why do you pay for this then? Why do you eat this? Uh, I'm trying to not eat those kind of thing but what no, no, but you do though so, but let's be fair um, like, let's be fair yes, when you go of out course. so let's just say you're out and about right now right you're traveling you go and you buy a bacon sandwich would you uh -huh. eat a bacon sandwich yes okay you're eating this you're paying for this to happen i know and this is why i'm trying to eat less meat so you eat some of this though just a little yes, less of course so no, how no, much no, of no. this is okay but there is uh, some companies that uh, kill animals in a more appropriate way who? Um, you tell me. I don't have names right now, but for example, they don't exist. No, for example, in um, in, in Muslim France? countries, in Muslim countries, in Muslim countries, um, there is a religion. It's called halal. The Islamic, yes, and it says that you can kill animals, but you can't hurt them, and you have to do it in a very appropriate way. And, and what is the way? Tell I me. mean, you can't like. Um, do you eat halal meat? What? Do you eat Muslim? animals yes you eat muslim meat yes okay so so when you go out you say is this halal no not not every time okay Before so you don't it was you don't so why do we care about this I, you, you're I, saying hypothetically uh, yes. you, you, you went you go from eating this to eating halal that's better yes okay of course but i'm trying so what how do they kill halal animals tell me um actually uh, i think it's all about belief what you believe how in. do they kill them um, they actually uh, pray to God before killing them. And that makes it okay. And it's supposed, if you believe in God, to uh, make them less suffer. Do you believe that? I actually believe that. But I mean, I think... So if I pray to God before I kill you, then you will suffer less? <laughs> no. Would that make it okay? Maybe. Who knows? Does that make it okay? Maybe. Who knows? Who knows? No. I don't care about what you can prove, not like... No, who knows? Uh, of course. But what I can prove right now, that... So what they do in Halal is they cut the animal's throat while they're fully conscious and the blood sprays out of their neck and they try to breathe through the hole in their neck and they yes. vomit out of there and they suffer for a minute before they die. Yes, it's sufferable. It's sorry, no, no, wait, wait a second, but you just said it's good. Yes, it's, no, like it's halal, what you are saying right now, it's horrible. Well, but is, this when is you believe, is. when you believe in God, but it's all about what you believe and what you have faith in. So if I believe in God, and I cut an animal's throat while they're fully conscious, that animal will suffer less. Maybe. I don't know, but... Well, how come the footage, when I watch halal slaughter footage, they don't suffer less, they yes, suffer more. I mean, don't you think it's better to do that than just, uh, like, the video you show me? No. I mean... Absolutely not. I don't know what's worse, going into a gas chamber or having my throat slashed open and being laid out trying to breathe out through the hole in my neck. Okay, I understand what you're saying. You know the RSPCA, they don't even approve halal slaughter. Okay, I understand. Yeah. Um, so, but, but what I'm trying to say is, why would you tr try to find the right way to cut an animal's head off when you can just be vegan? <laughs> because, I mean, now you're telling me to not eat animals anymore. 
I'm saying but that don't you, don't you, you think my body will miss something? No, I've been... I, how, like, do I look unhealthy to you? Do I look like I'm gonna die? No, you will not die, but you do will, I look you like will I'm be not weak. Eating? You maybe will be... You think I'm gonna be weak? Yes. You think I'm weaker than you? <laughs> no, no, not yet, maybe. Not yet? I'm not, not yet. How long do you think I'll be vegan? But I mean, if... How long do you think I, I have mean, been a vegan for? Is there a lot of scientists that yeah. say that okay. uh, the human body needs... I get what you're saying. You're, you're, you're concerned about there being some nutrients missing? Yes, exactly. Okay. So let me just ask you this. If you find out you can be healthy and vegan, do you think it would be wrong to kill animals for food? What? Can you repeat? If you found out that you can be a healthy vegan, that you wouldn't miss anything, would you then think it is wrong to kill animals for food? I don't know. I don't know, but I see that since... What do you mean you don't know? No, Tell me. You, if you think you, you, it's okay to kill them because we need to for health, if you found out you can be healthy as a vegan, you don't okay, need to do it yes, anymore. Of course, so I then would. It's bad. So then it's bad if we don't need to do it. I mean... Is it bad to kill animals if we don't need to for yes, our health? Okay, it's okay. Bad. Okay, yes, okay. yes. So if, if you found out that we had information that showed that you can be healthy eating plant-based, no, no animals, no animal product. Okay. If you found that out, you would agree it's, it's, it's very bad. But it's not possible. It's not possible. Okay, prove me that I can be vegan and be in perfect health. I mean, there is a massive um, peer-reviewed study that. by the Academy of Nutrition and Dietetics, and this is the biggest group of nutrition professionals on earth who brought out a peer-reviewed uh, statement saying that vegan diets can be healthy for all stages of the life cycle, Pregnancy, infancy, athletes, okay. the elderly, and this is, and it can reduce uh, certain diseases, and it's better for the environment. Uh, vegan, I can show you this data and if, if you like. And if I want to uh, grow my muscles, yeah, and you can get protein. I th uh, how? I mean, my muscles are probably bigger than yours. <laughs> yes, because... fill them. Go on. <laughs> yes, right. But I mean, <laughs> they're not that big. I'm just joking. Go on, settle mean... down. I'm only joking. But I'm just saying, my arms are bigger yes, than yours. Okay, I should but... be disintegrating right now. Okay, so I have a question. Do you think animals can be vegan too? Like, you mean carnivorous animals? I mean, animals? for example, a like wolf. A, 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 do you a think wolf? a wolf can be vegan? God, I mean, the, I, I, no, a, a, veganism is a philosophy that you... Yes, it's a philosophy. You, you believe animals should not be exploited and, and killed, right, for an unjustifiable reason. Yes. A wolf cannot hold that philosophy. A wolf cannot say... But how uh, do you know that? Are, maybe, you, maybe are you, you in Zen like dog, Okay, let me, let me say this. A dog, if you teach a dog not to harm other animals, you can do that. Yes. And then you can give them a plant-based diet that is formulated uh, with, uh, so they take the fiber out of plants and they formulate the protein out of plants and put all the supplements in there and you can give them that, right? That, okay. that In a domesticated household, you can do that. But can I go out into nature and turn a lion vegan? No, I can't no. tell a lion to stop no, raping can't. other lions either. No, you They're going to do that. So just because a lion won't be a rapist... Because it's not natural. I no, mean, no, no, wait a animals second. Rape need... is natural. It's nature. Rape happens in nature all the time. I mean... Think about it. No, wait, wait. Stay here at natural. <laughs> lions rape each other. They uh, don't ask for consent. Yes. This is what? Well, if, if I said, uh, you know, uh, excuse me, Your Honour, I know that <laughs> this horrible crime happened, but lions rape each other all the time. It is, but... what? I, it's I, natural. It's nature, and I just don't understand. It has been two thousand years, maybe more. I'm gonna, I'm gonna help you out here for a second because help if you me. get stuck on this nature thing, okay. it's called something called a logical fallacy, and it's called an, an, an what you're doing is you're appealing to nature to justify something in ethics, and you can't justify something by saying it's natural because, and because, this is why, yes. because in nature there are good things like delicious fruits and bad things like raping and killing, so you can't say something is is ethical by virtue of it being natural. Okay. Because you know what else is natural? Cyanide. Tsunamis. And you can't say, well, tsunamis are good because they happen in nature. Sure, but... So you see how you're contradicting yourself by saying it's natural? So you're picking meat eating as natural and saying that's good. Are, are tornadoes that kill a bunch of people good? Yes, but... I mean, yes, it's nature. They're nature. They're, they're, <laughs> it's, it's nature, nature, so it's good. Is malaria okay. good? Okay. Okay. Malaria kills millions of people. Is, is malaria good? So, it's all about... I see. You can answer the okay, question. No, no, no. What is the question? Is malaria that kills millions of people from mosquitoes, it's naturally occurring, is that good? No, it's not good, of course. But it happens in nature. But so you're comparing two no, 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 different I'm, things. No, I'm just, no, no, I'm just talking about, for now, we're not talking about animals, I'm just talking about, okay. is it, is, because it happens okay. in nature mean that it's good? No. 
Mm. Okay. Of course not. So now we've got the nature thing off the table. Okay. You can't say that because meat eating happens in nature, it's good. Yes, but we already say that there is good thing and bad thing. Exactly. So you can't say that because it's natural, meat eating is ethical. Okay, but you can't also say that eating other animals is a bad thing. Of course it's bad. Okay. It's horrible to be eaten. Okay, so... Do you want to be eaten? Of course not, but does okay, well, the, no, okay, no. okay. But does the apple does an apple want to an be eaten? Doesn't know what it wants. It's an apple. How do you know that? Maybe it has a conscious. How do you know this chair doesn't want to not be sat but on? How do you know that? You sat on this chair without asking the chair. <laughs> yes, but it's not the same thing. Apple is like when you pick an apple from a tree. You think an apple was like feeling that? Maybe we don't know. Well, if you don't know, are you are you sure? You need then? evidence to prove that. Of course, but do you have evidence to prove that an apple yes, feels something? Yes, of course. Oh, you do. Show me. Okay, not. Exactly an apple, but okay. no, no, no. Show me that an apple feel, apple feels something. <laughs> is this your mum? <laughs> is this your mum? <laughs> there she is. She's giving you information. She's she. Ah, oh, you see, you got a teamwork happening. So, so anyway, we want to talk about if apples feel pain. Okay. No, for example, no, no, no. Not apple, for example, but for example, scientists proved that. Sh prove to me. Show me the study. That um, this, I, I've got out something up for I you. I don't know, really know what was Did the plants article, feel pain? but it's about water. Water is, uh, for example, when you put music... Uh, I know the thing, and you freeze yes, the water and it's got yes, the... I know the study. Yes, so... And they, they think good things about the water. That doesn't mean the water is a conscious <laughs> being. How do you know that? Well, because... You, 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 can, you because can't prove me that, water, and I can't prove you that too. No, so. you, no, because the burden of proof is on the person making the claim. That's how the burden of proof works. Do you know what the burden of proof is? No. If you're going to make a claim, you have to back it up with evidence. I don't have to prove that plants don't feel pain. You have to prove they do. You're making a positive claim. Of course, but I, I, I didn't say that they feel something. I just say, you're saying I'm, you don't I, know. I'm, I'm just saying well, yes. It doesn't we don't matter because anything that you assert with no evidence, I can dismiss with no evidence because you haven't provided any evidence. Um, so unless you've got evidence to show me that tree feels something, then we can just throw yes, that argument away. I don't have evidence, but I mean, okay, well, it's, well, it's all about beliefs. We don't have to talk about it's, that. It's then. all about beliefs. We've got evidence. No, no, we've got evidence that you feel pain, that animals feel pain, because they've got of a course. brain, nervous yes. system, and yes. they, yeah. So, yes, but I mean, I think being vegan is, so, so is no, more no, about no, no, it's a philosophy. Let, let's wait a second. Wait a second. No, because it's, it's rooted in, in facts and, and science as well, because we know that animals don't want to be eaten. Of course. Yeah, and if I put you in, in nature with a lion, yes. would you want to be eaten? No, but... What would you want me to do to that lion if they try to eat you? To stop yeah, but Let's just say I had a gun. All right, you're in nature with a lion. Okay. A lion's going to eat you. Yes. And should I just kick back and go, it's nature, bro. Nature's <laughs> ethical. And you're screaming, help me. Help me. And I said, you know what? You know how you said that about the pigs and about the cows. It's nature. They deserve to die because it's nature. Well, you know, you're in a cow's position now. It's nature. Okay. Or I could shoot the lion and protect you and drag you out of nature because nature's horrible often. But how can you explain that? Can you answer that? What? Would you want to be dragged away from the lion and saved? Of course, but it's not possible. It's nature, because though. Because it's nature. No, and no, if I was there to rescue you from nature... <laughs> yes, would you I, would, to... I would ask you to save me, of but course. The, the, but the lion needs to eat me. Yes. We, well, but so what would he... The yes, lion but needs if, to eat if, you. If he doesn't... You wouldn't want to be a participant. Yes, but if he doesn't eat me, he will die. Would you want to be a participant in that food chain? Of course not, I... Okay, well, wait no, a second. Nobody lion? wants it. You but said food chain. That's the food chain. A okay, lion wants to eat but you. But the lion is going to die. Even if we don't eat him, if you don't... If so you save, so just, should the lion be able to kill you? I mean, if he can't eat me because you saved me, he will die. Okay, what I'm trying to show you, right, is that a food chain yes. and nature, these aren't ethical things. These but are horrible means... things and we shouldn't copy them or mirror them because they are they're horrible. But I mean... So we can't say, but... hey, you know what, I kill torture, kill chickens because it's the food chain or I kill cows because it's nature. I care about what is ethical. Do you understand the, the separation? I understand. Yeah. But it's your point of view and I think everybody can make... Well, you don't agree with what I just said? Because you haven't provided like a counterpoint. I mean, to me... In my opinion, I think it's all about the fact that since the dawn of time, we are doing it, and why should we follow your okay. opinion that... It's not an opinion. Your philosophy? Well, you haven't debunked it. What does that mean? You haven't um, proved me wrong. How do you want me so to... So let's just say, just go dawn of time. You want to go use dawn of time as a justification? Yes. Okay, 
Let's do that. So this is the same, I'm teaching you how to think logically here as well, because okay. I think that you're using justifications that are logical fallacies. So dawn of time, we've been doing eating animals from the dawn of time, so we should keep doing it? I mean, it depends on everything. So let's just say, are there other things that have happened since the dawn of time that we should not do? Okay, you said before that uh, in nature, there is bad thing and good thing. There is good thing we must keep doing and bad thing we must we stop. And, and what about the dawn of time? Is there good and bad things in the dawn of time? I think it depends on your point of view. Well, we've raped and killed and pillaged and, you know, tortured and done all these things since probably the dawn of time. Okay, I just No, 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 no don't, don't change the subject. We stay on the dawn of time. Okay. I want to get dawn of time off the table. Okay. So you agree that bad things have happened since the dawn of time? Yes. So does that mean that we can justify something because it's always happened? No. Okay. But so then you can't justify eating animals because it's mean, happened. Right now you're saying that killing animals to eat them is a bad thing, but I don't think so. I think you know, from, not from your perspective, from the animal's perspective, is it bad? Of course. That's what I want to know. Of course but, it's bad to be an animal. Think but, of a chicken. But animals want to eat me too. I mean, if tomorrow I'm in the forest, like you I'm say, and you are not and you are not here to save me from the lion, he will eat me, but that's and the I life. That, and I think that's bad. The, but that's the life. You can say to every bad. animal, stop eating other animals, they will all die. I'm talking to you in England right now, who okay. lives in France, who's a human <laughs> being, who can rationalize. I'm not talking to a lion. But like I said, I can't I can't stop a lion from raping other lions. No. But human beings shouldn't do it. And I wouldn't say, hey, you know, you're not going to stop all the lions from raping other lions, but, you know, human beings shouldn't act like that. And you shouldn't say, well, you know what, <laughs> I'm going to keep doing it because lions do it, bro. It's natural. It's been happening since the dawn of time. And um, what was the other one? It's it's a some type of chain or something. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, uh, I understand, but I, I actually consider your point of view. And you just have to know that I already think about being vegan and I'm trying to reduce my... Uh, you're killing of other beings. Yes, you want to say that. But, I mean, okay, when you kill, by mistake, a butterfly. For okay, example. this is your mum's butterfly <laughs> argument? <laughs> no. Okay. So, she what just, if I accidentally just, kill another? She just said me that what, God we, created okay. us like that. Uh, God created us to eat meat? <laughs> yes. If God created us to eat meat, why do, why do we get heart disease from eating too much meat? Uh, why, do, why can't you watch an animal be slaughtered if God created us like that? I God mean, created you, because, why do you feel bad? Because what you, what you show me is torture, but I don't want to torture animals. Have you seen uh, an animal just be, uh, without being tortured, being killed and have their head cut off and their guts pulled out? I mean... It's not nice. No, but... Yeah, but, but if you were made to eat meat, you wouldn't think anything of it. But I don't know how to explain, to explain it, but... You know why? Because you're an animal too, right? We're, we're both human I, animals. Yes. Non -human, there's non-human animals, we're human animals yeah and when you see another being who are like us get their head cut off we automatically feel compassion because yes, we're not yes it murderers. breaks my heart okay so but if god made you like your mum said god made us to be killers to eat meat yes do you think a lion's heartbroken when they're ripping an antelope to shreds and they're still alive no it's horrible do you think a lion sits there and goes i'm heartbroken but we have we have to kill him in a good way not by torturing if them you have to kill them yes but i don't like let me give you this scenario so you understand I can either torture you and kill you, or kill you without any suffering. I'm always going to choose killing you without any suffering. Okay. okay. Now, so you've got animals here. We can torture them in factory farms and kill them. We can try to find a more humane way to kill them. Or, we can not kill them. Which is the most ethical? Of course. No, honestly, if everybody was... Can you answer the question before we move on? Okay. Which is the most ethical? Torture and kill them? Kill them humanely? Or not kill them? Not kill them. Okay. But honestly, if everybody would be with vegan, I would be too. But wait, 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 wait. Yes. So you will only act in a moral way until everyone else does? Yes, because okay. I act this way why? because I know that... I mean, if everybody was vegan, I but would why? definitely... Because... Imagine, no one's going to go vegan if you okay, have that attitude. But if though. tomorrow I would be vegan, I, I know that there is a lot of people that would keep uh, eating meat and it will not change. Okay, let me just... Remember how before I told you People are always going to kill each other. People are always going to be cruel to dogs, but I don't. It's the same thing. Okay. Just because everyone else is going to do something, you've chosen not to. So you've stopped putting your demand, your money to kill animals. That's your decision. You know, you can't control what everyone does, yeah. but you can be part of the change. And if you're against it, 
Like, if you think it's bad, most of the time you're eating stuff like this, I guarantee you. Because statistically, it's factory farms and yeah. slaughterhouses. But um, can't you make moral decisions for yourself? Why do you have to look for of course, the crowd? Um, I think I can be the changement that I want to see in the world. And I would prefer to be vegan, of course, but you know, it's not... You would prefer? Of course I would. Okay. I mean, what, what, I mean so, so it, it breaks my heart to, to eat meat, you know? These animals, what do you think the animals feel? Uh, I don't think they... we're always talking about how you feel about it, how humans feel about it. But they can't actually feel anymore because uh, they're dead. No, but before... But before, but, but yeah. How, so if you could have a conversation with a cow right here, what do you think they would feel? If, if you said, I'm going to have to kill you humanely to eat your body, what do you think the cow would say if they could speak to you? It's horrible. They don't want to be eat. They would say, don't... What do you think the cow would say to you? Don't... If you had a gun to their head. If they could speak. Don't kill me? Yeah. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> okay, so I have to go. But uh, I think, of course, vegan are right. But in our world nowadays, I don't think it's possible that everybody change their uses. Because the we power is in your hands. I'm asking you to make a decision for your heart. Oh, of course. And you don't. I can already tell you. Really, I was questioning what type of person you were. But now I know that you are compassionate. Yes, of course. Because if a cow doesn't want to die, you wouldn't kill them. Yes. But I promise you, I will try to be vegan. Okay, well, that was really nice talking to you. Okay. And I really, you can zap this. This is your vegan challenge. It's called Challenge 22. Okay. And they help you what to eat and things like this. Okay. But you should follow your heart. Yes. Stop thinking up here, follow your heart. You're right. Because there's a lot of excuses for what we yeah. do, but I think uh, the, the best way to reduce harm to animals is to be vegan. I agree. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Nice talking to you. Thanks. What was your name again? Marianne. Marianne. Thank you for the debate. It was very, it was very passionate. And, Thank you uh, for you. <laughs> appreciate it. I didn't expect her to give me so much fire, like to, to to be so. That was a great debate. That was a good discussion. I have to thank her really because that was a good discussion. And at the end, when I asked her what would the cow say to you, and she said that would say don't kill me, and that's where I think the penny dropped. And that was that was when I've got to go now. <laughs> Got her to think, you know, and that if you can get someone away from that logical mind into their heart, I think that's what happened then. She started to feel it for the animals. Really good.